mom searched on YouTube a recipe for pasta with fresh tuna, and only a couple of videos came up, and not even very interesting. So she thought, let's cook something different today, and she went out to the fish market with Julia. If you want to try this brand new recipe, get ready with the ingredients. Mom will also share a special tip at the end of the video. Make sure you keep watching. Ciao a tutti! The dish of today is very traditional one. Pasta with the tuna, but with the one big difference. I will use fresh tuna. Step number one. Let's start. Let us prepare a basic fish stock. Put some olive oil in a pan, a garlic clove, and the bones of a tuna, not the head, please. Ginger. And lemon grass. Brown with high heat for a few minutes. Add 2.5 liters of water. Add salt and take to boiler for around 20 minutes. Let the stock boil until one third of it is evaporated. Now, strain your stock with a fine strainer, which is slow, or medium strainer, which is faster. The fish stock is ready. Step number two. Prepare the tuna tata. You need to deep freeze the tuna fillet for safety reasons. We cut it into pieces that are a bit bigger than in the normal tata. Zest a bit the lemon and ginger. Add some oil and a pinch of salt. Mix well. Put it aside to marinate for several minutes while we continue with the rest of the recipe. Step number three. Turn on the burner. Let us prepare toasted breadcrumbs. Put an anchovy in the pan and add the breadcrumbs. I have to stir faster because I want the bread toasted, not the burn. When the breadcrumbs have a golden brown color, turn off the burner. Put them aside for later. Well done so far. Step number four. I prepare the tomato. A little extra virgin oil. A little more than a little. Garlic. Press the garlic clove, keeping the skin. Make sure there is high heat. Chili. Tomato. Keep stirring for a few minutes while you lower the heat. Remove the garlic to avoid that its flavor overpowers the tomatoes. When you are done, add some salt and capers mixing a last time. Step number five. Now, we want to make sure that the pasta really soaks in the ingredients absorbing all the flavors. So instead of cooking pasta in the traditional way in hot boiling water, we will cook it in our fish stock. So put the pasta in the boiling fish stock for a few minutes. When the pasta is still hard, move it into the hot tomatoes. As soon as the water is absorbed or evaporates, add more fish stock. Mix. Repeat a few times until the pasta is al dente. This is a different way of cooking pasta. It's not mom's invention, but it's quite traditional in Italy. It deserves a whole video to talk about it. All is ready. It's time to prepare the final dish. All 
so this time, Mommy really nailed the new recipe. Why don't you try it at home? Remember to leave your comments below, subscribe, and smash that bell to stay updated on the next episodes of Tony's Home.